lady and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is the first video in my five part series. So make sure that you subscribe to my channel and also hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos which I'm going to post this week. Also, if you guys are not following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so so you get a little sneak peek of what I'm going to do next. So for today's video, I decided to do a last minute gift idea in case you're not prepared for Christmas because totally I'm not prepared for Christmas. And yeah. Just comment down below and tell me if you are prepared or if you are not prepared for Christmas. And I hope you guys like this video. And if you just give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And without further ado, let's get into it. Scrunchies are a huge thing and they look absolutely pretty. So it would be a great way to give someone scrunchies. And also the best part is they are super easy to make. So take any fabric of 4 by 16 inches, then fold that in half. And I'm just doing the basic stitch. Once you're done stitching, turn your fabric inside out. Then stitch the remaining edges that you have left. And your scrunchie is ready. This gift idea is one of my favorite and to whoever you'll give it, they'll be so happy to receive it. For this, all you guys need is some red paper and some candies. Wrap your candies into the red paper and stick them in the shape of a bomb. Then to finish it off, go ahead and add a cute customable note which says you are a bomb and I think to whoever you'll give it, they will be so happy to receive it. All these rings are super easy and are super affordable. To make this one, all you guys need is wire. So taking a piece of wire, I'm just going to loop it around a circular object. And if there is any extra wire, I'm just going to cut it. And I just pressure fitted them to each other. So there is no extra wire and it's so simple yet it looks so cute. For this ring, you need a long piece of wire. Then taking a circular object, you're just going to loop around. And if you take a long wire, you'll have longer loops. And if you have this wire, you'll have smaller loops, obviously. For this one, I'm doing the exact same thing as the previous one, but this time I thought I'll add a pearl so it will look extra cute. So taking my pearl, I'm just going to add it to the middle section of the loop and secure it in place with some hot glue. I'm so happy how it turned out and it looks so cute. This one is my absolute favorite and it's so easy. For this ring, I'm just going to take a wire and clamp it upwards just to make angle and then bend upwards. And then taking a circular object, I'm just going to loop it round and then pressure fit the edges together. This gift idea is something you could give to your friend or maybe to yourself. For this, all you guys need is some candies. Place all the candies into a cute jar. And to make it a little fancier, I just added a red ribbon with a custom note. So that is it for my video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you are new here, make sure that you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos which I'm going to post this week. Also, if you guys are not following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so so you get a little sneak peek of what I'm going to do next. So I hope you guys like this video and if you just give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.